this is the story of how me, my grandparents, and my sister, baby sister, had a lockdown at JCPenney's. By the way, I posted a video um, that was showing everything that happened because it was supposed to be back to school shopping video, but it went horribly wrong. So if you'd like to go check that video out, do it right now. Anyway, so yeah. So I was just going to have a fun, just trying to have a fun day, go back to school shopping with my grandparents, my baby sister as well. And it was super fun, so I started recording. Uh, and I was really excited. I was having a great time. And then, so we first shopped for dresses and tried on dresses. We found a dress that I liked. And then we went upstairs to shop for backpacks. So while we were shopping for backpacks, by the way, this was at Jason Penny's mall. Anyway, so while we were shopping for backpacks, uh, one of the employees yelled in the middle of the upstairs of the mall and was like everyone needs to go downstairs so she ran around the entire upstairs of the mall and was like you need to go downstairs you need to go downstairs and so i was like why do we need to go downstairs so she didn't answer my question so i was just like okay well let's just go downstairs so then um somebody okay so then when we went downstairs every she was leading the employee was leading everybody outside and I was wondering why. And I was still curious of what was happening. So then finally, one of the employees um, there explained what was happening. And they said, um, so they started explaining what happening. So what was happening? So what happened was that some two, two guys uh, had weapons and um, they broke into the jewelry store. They broke the glass stole some jewelry and then they stole two purses as well so i was super scared we were having a lockdown and we couldn't go any close to any doors or windows because we were having a lockdown i was scared i was freaking out especially because i was with my baby sister that was 12 months and then um like literally after like so i almost started crying so i um so me and so everybody a lot of people were going outside even though it was raining uh so we didn't go outside because our car was on the other side of the mall and that's where the robbery happened on the other side of the mall and we had no idea if the robbers had backup um outside so we didn't go outside so we went to the clothes section hit between clothes and then um we heard a gunshot so, since it was raining, we didn't know if it was a gunshot or thunder, but we're pretty sure we heard a gunshot. So, I started crying, and um, then I was like, we're praying, guys. It's okay. Well, I didn't start, a, I didn't start crying, but I was like, we're praying. It's going to be okay. Um, I hid a lot. So, I hid under this clothes thingy, if you didn't know what they are. They're kind of like benches, but with clothes on them. And so, I hid on, under one of them. Uh, then I went out and hid between, like, clothes, uh, a clothes aisle or something. And I went on my phone, started, um, trying to get my mind off it, trying to distract myself. So I started to try to play on my phone to get my mind off of, um, what every, what things, um, what all the things were happening right now. And then I started thinking, what could happen to me right now? Like all of the bad stuff that could happen to me right now, I could die. So I started crying and then, yeah. So at this point, my parent, my grandparents were pulling out their guns. By the way, this was just to defend yourself because they didn't know if the um, robbers also had guns to, um, ch ch anyway. So yeah, uh, yeah, my grandparents were starting to pull out their guns after 30 minutes of waiting i was crying i was scared my baby sister was calm because she had no idea what was going on at the time because she was 12 months she didn't understand anything so um my grandparents put her in the stroller and i was like please make us okay please just please i was crying i was so scared i was freaking out and then um and then after like an hour of waiting of waiting um one of the employees said that so one of no what happened was that um sorry it was a long time ago it was like two months ago so yeah 
I kind of forgot what happened, but I'm still shooken up about it. Anyway, so what happened was then I heard police sirens, and I also heard, and I also saw red and blue flashing lights outside of the window. And so the cops were here. They went um, in the mall. They found the guys. They arrested them, and we were still in lockdown. Uh, but turns out the robbers were found with two weapons. One of them was guns. Um, and yeah, the, um, that was the only information we got, but I was still very scared and I didn't, I just wanted to go home. So we quickly shopped for some shoes and we just went home. We paid, we went home and, uh, the next day it was on the news. And, uh, so yeah, um, nothing has happened ever since. So ever since that has happened, nothing has happened ever since, but I'm still very shooken up about it. So if you guys like the story time, make sure to smash that like button, subscribe to my channel if you're not, turn all the notifications, I love it so much. I'll see you guys in the next video, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash that bell so you will be notified when I post a new video, and you will never miss out on my new videos. By the way, if um you like this story time, please make sure to comment um if you like me to do another one of these crazy story times. Um, But yeah, sorry this story time is a bit short. If you would like to see the whole entire story of it, go check out the video where I was going back to school shopping. It is called Going Back to School Shopping, blah, 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 but then it went horribly wrong, everything. But yeah, if you would like to go check out that video, go check it out. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, yeah. So, yeah. Bye, everybody.